सो हेलो 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 एवरी वन दिस इज अंशु सिंह यर योर होच फॉर द टूर्नामेंट एंड दिस इज द थर्ड डे ऑफ द टूर्नामेंट थर्ड राउंड एंड यर वी आर विद द लाइव स्ट्रीम आई नो दैट इज अ बिट डिले बट देर वॉज सम टेक्निकल इशू विद द बोर्ड सो दैट्स वाई वी कूडेंट सी द गेम्स लाइव दैट्स वाई यू हैड टू वेट बट आई थिंक नाउ द गेम्स आर लाइव एंड नाउ यू कैन स्टार्ट अप विद द स्ट्रीम इट मी जस्ट एडजस्ट द बोर्ड Yeah. This is the audio proper. Can you please check and let me know? ओके एक्चुअली लीचेस पे नहीं आ रहे हैं हम लोग चेस डॉट कॉम पे आई एम करेंटली एट चेस डॉट कॉम ठीक है ना या आई एम जस्ट एसर्टिंग अप राइट नाउ ओके एंड वन no issues we are back again the technical staff has helped us helped us and now i think all the games will be live again let me just set up the board add the souls Give me just one second. I'm just setting up the board. copy paste
Okay, so here we are back again with the games. I think this should be fine. Yep. Yep, so sorry for the delay guys now we are getting starting up with the stream so currently let's check out some games uh, first of all uh, let's just check the chess results what's the status what are the pairings for today third round okay so as you guys can see i will just show you the screen yep so as you guys can see the first round is between pune and nagpur so ridesh is my audio clear can you just check and let me know quickly is the audio video proper all clear okay great okay so here we are with the first table which is between pune versus nagpur okay so Pune versus Nagpur and the second is again Pune versus Pune. Okay, so basically it's between Savitri Bai and Bharati Vidyapit. The third is between our host university, which is HSNC University and University of Mumbai. Oh, this this is going to be interesting. The top three boards are very good, very much interesting. Obviously, I'm supporting our university. They should win, uh, though they have worked a lot hard. Um, the fourth is between Sivaji University, Kolhapur and Veer Narmad, South Gujarat University, okay. Fifth is between Maharaja University of Barodra and the uh, opponent is Devi Aliya University, which is Indore, Ahiya, Ahilya. Um, the next is between Jabalpur and Nashik. The next is between Rajkot University versus Maharaja. Okay, the next is between Bikaner versus Gujarat University. I think uh, all this game seems to be equal because if you noticed yesterday there was an imbalance in the pairing because there was all the strong players were paired against unrated and today I can see the pairing is at least there is a balance between the pairing. Both of the sides have rated players. So I think this is going to be interesting. Uh, anything can happen. So today's day is very much crucial for the players and we are going to stream all the games so stay tuned guys so these are all the pairings i can't obviously i can't read each and every name but these are the pairings for today and the top three pairings which we are going to see is the world peace university pune versus rtmnu the next is between bharti vidya bit versus savitri by phule and next is between hsnc university versus university of mumbai so this three tables we are going to check out and i think it's going to be a very much interesting game so let's come back to the live screen okay here we are on the live screen and let's start up with the chess.com yeah here we can see the number of rounds so let's check out Okay, the first game which we are going to see is between W I am Brudul. I think Brudul is again the third highest rated player in the tournament. Her opponent is Ria. And okay, Brudul is black and Ria is white. Currently, the position seems to be equal. And I think uh, white has a slight edge over in this position. Though anything can happen, this is a complete theory. And both of the players are pretty much playing well. Both of them are uh, rated. See in this in this position, okay, it's white to play. Um, and you can just go for some developments. I think that should be fine. Bishop e seven, sorry, bishop e three. Bishop e three should be fine. I think this just this just development. Develop your pieces, or you can go also this. You can also go knight to d two. This is also fine. Knight d two, bishop e uh, bishop to e three. And obviously black is planning for bishop and castle. Okay, so we'll come back to this game again. Till the time, let's go to some other games. Some water. Right? 
the players are currently focused um let just let me check something okay yeah, everything is proper let's check akansha's game she is the top seed of the tournament akansha wm though she was uh, very much higher rated she was i think she crossed 2200 before right now her rating is currently 2149 and okay this oh why it is actually go doing good in this position i think it's pretty equal uh we'll come to back to this game also because uh, there is nothing much to analyze both of these players will just go with development here i think black will go bishop d6 to support this pawn um yeah and white will just castle black will go here then knight to c3 knight to f6 so both of the sides will just start with the development so we'll come back to this game again okay let's check rishita birla's game okay she is actually the player of hsnc university she is and currently she is rated 1003 her opponent is 1365 which is kima averle kima okay a3 this position is currently equal i think uh, at some point black may maneuver the knight from here to g6 square or e3 e6 square anything also uh, c5 break can come in at some point so yeah i think white can just go for rook to d1 prepare for some development stuff and black's plan will be just to play c5 or either he will maneuver the knight start uh, activating his pieces to more active squares next game Okay, this game is between Riddhi versus what's the name? Okay, Mahesh Somani, Riva Mahesh Somani. Okay, this is also seems to be okay. Currently, we are just watching the all the games which have just started right now. Also, there is a fifteen minutes delay, so the moves which we are seeing are already played much much before on the board. Let's see what happens during the game. Black pieces are well placed, actually. All the pieces are active. White has also done a great job. All the pieces are active. All the pieces can just keep flowing on the board, and I think uh, F5. Okay, the engine shows F5, but I don't. Like a for a human being who would play f5? Like obviously we will just think to develop the bishop and just castle. That is the move which I like. Also, I d5 at some point. Not so early. We'll see the game. The next is between Sanya versus Sia Thakre. So this is the game. Oh, uh, eight. What, why why we can't see the time over here just let me refresh the page okay and now we can see about this one okay in this position okay black has just recently castled right now I I think this is also a uh, equal position as this is the opening. As we move on further in the middle games, we'll come to know uh, what is the actual position of the game, who is better, who is not. Uh, as such, to all the boards, I can see or uh, it's an equal game going on right now. So we saw Rishita's game. Let's check out Shruti's game. Shruti versus Mahajan Mokshada, Mokshita Mahajan. Oh, they have they have played so fast actually. 
so now they are on the verge of exchanging the queens but i don't think this was a great idea to exchange the queens because now after exchanging definitely white is going to capture knight into e5 and i think he is better he is clearly better black is clearly better over here you can see the number of pawns after i think he uh, black is clearly better he is two pawns up after that and i think you should just exchange the queens and play knight e5 i think that's the best move you can do uh, that's why i didn't like knight to b3 you shouldn't have exchanged the queens here but i think uh, mokshita mahajan should win this game and as you can see the bar the bar is also showing the same thing black is uh, clearly better over here um if you look on to some other games uh, by the way one game Let's look on to this game. Usha Panda versus David Avril. Avril David. Done, no? Yeah. David Avril's game, and uh, I think though it's, it seems to be equal, but it's not actually. It's, there is a, so much imbalance in the position. That let's see if you take this bishop. I think uh, it will be pawn into f7, and I think I would love to play with white over here. But I think what what black's move is bishop into d3, pawn into f7. Engine shows black is better, but I think I would prefer white in this position because I think uh, it will be easy to play, and I love attacking play during the game. So that's why I think I would I would play with white. After bishop into d3, queen into d3, uh, pawn into f7, king into f7. Uh, though there, there is not a direct attack, I would say, because knight to f6 is covering everything. So the players have to plan and think how they are going to proceed further. We'll come back to this game. This is an interesting game, actually. Uh, this can you just uh, we have a guest joining in actually at 11 pm okay just let me send him the link with this you have forwarded me the link right okay i've got it. Let's check once the player's board. Let's check the player's camera. What are they doing? Okay, so we have HSNC University over here. Okay, so the this one is HSNC. I think this is the top board and this is the second board over here. All the players are focused. Nagpur seems to be very strong actually because there are so much higher rated players in their team. I think in 5 minutes the guest will be joining and I have already forwarded the link. In second. As the players are now, so let's come back to the live game. Uh, we, in just five minutes, the guest is going to join in, and then we can have a great talk. Why it's not open?
Vidish, if anyone comes in the meeting, just admit him, okay? No, it's some issue. Let's start this. Okay, we have saw this game. Now we are going to check all the games which are the remaining ones. No, not needed. We have saw Rishita's game, we have saw Shruti's game, we have saw Sanya's game, Akansha's game. Okay, each and every game is almost covered. let's see this game okay this is the okay black is completely winning and the game is between Parnavi Rane versus Nilashri okay Nilashri is a player of HSNC University only uh, I think okay she's losing this game um, black is better in this position because black is a piece up as you can see black has an extra bishop and okay not a piece up okay Why is the time gun time not spent? Okay, in this board we can see. Not on the okay, not on the other one. Okay, got it. So both of them have an equal. But I think these two pawns are just crazy. I think at some point this is going to come. I think she played this move because she wants to capture the knight, but I think black has a brilliant move over here. I think you can just allow to capture at some point you can go for e5 and after e5 you can see that the, if the queen is on f6 you definitely can't capture the pawn with the knight because oh, it's defended twice and once these two pawns come here it's just ruining the entire position for white because after d3 even the bishop can't come out and I think this is just a great move you should uh, you can just go for h6 and that's uh, after bishop into f6 queen into f6 and you can plan for some e5 stuff that I think that seems to be better for me at least but though it's a classical game I think the players are going to calculate a lot though Nilishri engine is showing it's minus 5 but uh, I'm not looking at the bar right now I'm just thinking from their human perspective the bar though is showing it's black is completely winning and definitely it's winning only but still uh, can't say till the game ends The games are still going on. Let's see, let's check out some other interesting games. So we saw Nilishri's game. Let's check out Sara's game. Okay, so this is University of Mumbai versus MU. Okay, and I can see uh, Sara is uh, losing this game uh, due to the bar. The bar is just dancing up and down. And this is the position currently, and I think. Can just can uh cancel for this. Okay, white white will prepare to castle. But I think this move uh shouldn't be played because of this move brilliant and you're just getting a pin now. So I think because of this move uh black has made a blunder. This move was not required at all. Because now it's just bishop e5 also can come or oh, sorry bishop e4 also you can just castle as per the engine but i would just play bishop e5 and just win up the rook that's it it's a clear uh, piece up and i think it will be an easy convertible game so let's check out some other okay she played bishop e5 and uh, that was pretty much expected yeah yeah as we saw we saw currently we covered the hsnc university versus mu's game 
okay we have someone on the meeting hello 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 Raul sir can you hear me one second I, I think he is in the meeting I'll just message him. Okay, okay, one second. Okay, so let's start now. Okay, sir, so I will just show you some of the. First, I will show you the pairings for today. Okay. So, guys, let's start. So, I sorry for the so sorry for the technical issue, and let's just start up again. So, we have today arbiter FA Rahul Joshi sir with us, and now he is going to give us some analysis of his games. Uh, so, sir, can you see the screen first of all? Clear, all clear, all set. Okay. Okay, so I'm just opening the chess results. Yep. Okay, let's see, uh, see this uh, Kansha's game. Kansha is already forked. Yeah, it's a knife. Already rook is going. Yeah. Player is thinking, but the rook is gone, and then no other compensation. Yes. I think now after the rook moves, uh, they are just going to capture. But I think, sir, uh, white al already has an extra piece, and if it manages to capture the knight, I think it it seems. It will to be, be it will be fun because f7 yeah. is also under threat. Yeah, I think it's great. I think white is doing good here. Yeah. First, I saw Akansha's position obviously like rook, it's fork and everything. Yeah. But then, but then being a chess player, you have to see the whole board. <laughs> yeah, after I think so, rook d1. Yeah. Knight is here. I think uh, the rook is attacked. I think he will. He, she has to capture the rook. And probably she has after to capture the rook. And knight, then knight, knight into f7 is yeah. coming up with again a fork. Hmm. And like you mentioned, white is a piece up. Hmm. I think white should manage this game. Definitely. And I think it's should. a great shock for Akansha because she is again playing against a 1400 player, and uh, it will be a shock for the team if it at the start if she loses. It will be a Big shock. Big shock for the team. Big shock and a big upset as yeah. well. Winning against more than you can say 700, 800 point player. Mm -hmm. And she's a very experienced player, Akansha. Yeah, and actually, I think the opponent team wouldn't have expected this. I think they would have counted the points on some other road. This is a, maybe something. Yeah. I I don't know how the pieces like uh, you. She's pieced down. Mm. Maybe something. Might Let's have check happened. out from the start, now. Let's just see from the start. Yeah. What they did. Let's go to the yes. Okay. So e4, e5, knight f3. Okay, till now it's fine. Okay, d4. Okay. Okay, the queens are exchanged at the same. Queens are exchanged. Oh, till this position, the I saw the game. Till this position, I saw the game. Oh. The queens got exchanged. Oh, she played knight d4. Was it required? Or not the piece down? But I think it's good for white though. Yeah. Yeah. Knight d4 was not required. Bishop d Bishop d6 was seems to be better there. Yes. Just defend the pawn. And especially in a classical game, the players are playing so fast in this tournament, actually. Let's go to some other game. So Akansha's game, I think, I think still she will manage. Though there is a slight advantage for the opponent, but I think she will manage. 
being being such a experienced yeah. player she will manage and i think she, she had might, crossed... she must have calculated as well <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> actually i think uh, she was 20, more than 2200 uh she lost some points right now but i think she's yeah, maybe she was more than 2200 yeah. even i think so yeah and she has some great experience i think she will manage to, and i think yesterday's game also she just played uh, like phenomenal chess the last two games was she's just... a very experienced player yeah. so she has been in such situations many a times all right yeah it will be a just a cake of walk Okay, there are two rounds ended up. Okay, in this. Okay, so in Mokshita's game, okay, this has end. Um, but I think this is the. Uh, no. Yeah. Let's look at this game, sir. Siya Thakre versus Sania. What do you think about this position? Siya Thakre versus Sania. Okay. And seems over still the opening mid in the middle game right now. Black's position looks good for me. Yeah, there is a slight advantage pieces, for black here. Yeah, slight advantage for black. The pieces are well, you can say coordinated properly. Correct. All the pieces are developed. Both the rooks are connected. Queen is out. Queen is out. Black is little. Yeah. White is little bit behind in development, but little, yeah, little yeah. bit behind. And also, I can see in the start. Mm-hmm. the coordination of pieces you can say the pawn structure and many things are not well coordinated for white not that bad actually, yeah. obviously but, but it, black yeah. black seems good only a 0.6 advantage not more than that so i think it's yeah, not uh, that much but then by seeing you can say in normal language that design the pawn mm-hmm. structure everything looks little good for black yeah 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 <clears throat> normally mm-hmm. white has as an advantage in the opening which we were discussing but mm. still uh, black has surprised and has done a good work in the opening correct uh i think all most of the games are either in the middle game or uh, yeah. black is the uh, black is lower uh, in this right lower rated in this uh, uh yeah black is low black is actually 12, 1200 and white is 1490 One four nine six. So Black yeah. has done a good job in the opening. Yeah, very good. A win job. in the like you can say a win in the opening. She has yeah. got like equalized the position and ready for a good for her right. good attack now. I think she, just, she should just uh, control her nerves and the time control at the last. And I think because usually players get tense during the higher rated players and they. Yeah. Yeah. What is the time control for this? Sixty minutes. Yeah, sixty minutes, right? Yeah, sixty minutes plus thirty seconds. So, thirty seconds yeah. increment. So time control is also good. Yeah, we actually Proper have. Classical. Yeah, we have one more fide arbiter in front of us. He is managing everything right now. Okay. <laughs> come up, come on. Let's let's have a talk over here. So we have right now Yashwant with us. We are with us. Yashwant Power. Yeah. <laughs> so currently he is managing all the DGD boards. So hi Yashwant. Hi. uh i think you can't hear sir but uh, it's fine now. i will just uh, on, on the zoom over here ridesh can you just on the zoom so that he can hear yeah just on it on the phone no? okay so yashwant uh, first of all thanks for di- arranging all the digit boards and now we can see all the games live ha huh? nahi chalega uh so yashwant let's just check out some of you games sir uh, in this position she has played knight to e4 hmm Knight e4. Okay. It's, it's she wants to free up, like make way for the fair and chitta bishop. Correct. Um, I think she mm-hmm. just want to put pressure on this pieces. Yeah, she wants That's to why yeah, she want to pressure. Put pressure on the pieces. Uh, I, I, I have I, you, I, you on the zoom. On the zoom, 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 zoom. zoom, no? zoom. Okay. Yes. So I think she has. Play. He can defend it with Queen C two and Knight X Knight. And yeah, uh, uh, there's a triple attack. Triple attack. Okay, no. Right now. Right now. Can you hear can you hear him? him? Yes, yes, I I can uh, hear Yashwan. So he he's saying right like uh, White can play just Queen C two. Oh, there are oh, there are okay. She took with the Knight. Okay, she took with the Knight. 
I think I think now sorry it's sorry, a minus it's minus one. one. Yeah. No, that, no, that would, not would not make that, that much. Yeah. Like minus one is like okay, okay to okay, okay in this like sixty minutes thirty seconds plus they are, they are both around one is fourteen hundred and one is correct correct twelve hundred. So fourteen hundred could manage that a bit. Not yes. Not yes. Okay. As, As Raul sir mentioned, mentioned, in the opening, the opening she has won. For sure. For sure. Oh. Oh. That's opening she has won. Now she's doing good. Mm-hmm. Let's check Let's out some, check other, out some game. other game. And rating is just a number. You can just... Rating, rating is just a number. Yeah, sure. Number. Rating is definitely a number. Let's, Let's go, go on to some other games. Other games. Okay, okay, Kimea. Kimea. Okay, this is okay, this the is a, uh, uh, most university, university university tournament. tournament. HNSC versus University, 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 university of Mumbai. Mumbai. <laughs> this is going to, be, going a to be a clash. Kimea has played B4 position, trying to break queen side pawns. With... Can take it. I'm thinking like A takes B4, A takes B4, and now. This White has one more goal is like bishop on h3. Yeah. This is an interesting position with like the double rooks on the c file. Mm-hmm. And pieces are good for white. This is an interesting one. And like right. Ashwin was saying like it is an attack on the queen side. Mm-hmm. Black has some pieces on the queen side. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Correct. Correct. So as, so I, as can I can see, see right, right, right now, now. Can we push b5 at some point? B5, yes, can B5, yes, B5 could be one of the moves because uh, on the C file, double rooks are there. Yep. B5 is possible. Hmm. But what about after B5, he pushed the pawn to C5? Yep. Yep. Can he and push the pawn to C5? Like, B5, like, B5, like, it will, it will good be good for black. black. Somewhere, yeah. somewhere yeah. if you don't, yeah. you will yeah. play yeah. more C4 and then, and then lock, then lock down, down both the rooks. Then your, then your double, the rooks, the rooks are not that easy. Okay, okay, she takes. She took. Okay. Ending after, Ending 90, after 94, 95, 95, 95, putting, putting pressure. pressure. Yeah. So why did oh, why did doing great? But I want I want that sense to win. There are tough clashes. Yeah. Yeah. Rizal's game. Rizal's game. What happened? Check Akansha's game. What oh, happened? Yeah. Yeah. That position. Rudul's game is just it's going to go, going to go long. This, I'm, this seeing I'm seeing like live, live on the DGT boards. I am finding that I'm going on the place and checking also. Like they are literally played like ten moves or below only. It's delay, so it won't be like that fast. But they're really playing so smooth. Let's check out the players' board. Let's play to whom? Okay, wait, wait. Yes, yes. I have shared the screen, the screen so that we can But it looks like the screen. I think that we just can show one Yeah, so, yeah, as, so we can, as we can as we can see, like she has played king to, king to d1. d1. So she has, she has played king to d1. I'm thinking like, what are your goods? Like after knight rook, knight takes rook, knight takes f7 check, and then playing like king to seven. Both the knights have been like, it's like purely saying draw is like just exchanging the pieces, exchange of the pieces. I think they will decide on the results also. Yeah. This board might go on the board results, but and Akansha is like WIM. She was like, she would be prepared for this. Yeah, she was also prepared for the board prizes. Board prizes. 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 Correct. Correct. So she, so she won't want, want, want to lose. Akansha must be shocked after this, maybe. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Akansha yeah, can can is in day one. Day one. Might might in rook, rook, and then, then might to might F7. To F7. Great game, Great going, game on. going on. 
I hope I, hope I think they have one, one game is finished like uh, HSNC HS board, board, board. Board, board. board I think that I think that already late no it's no, it's, it's, it's finished, finished. Like, finished. Uh, it's round it's round, 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 round. round. no 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 scroll down just type, just type Sarah, Sarah in, the in the search oh yeah oh yeah Okay, Let's check Let's out, check out Usha's, Usha's game. game. So this so is basically the players, players of HSNC University. University. And, and this position, this position seems, seems fine. fine. Actually, she's, a, so she's a beginner. And she's playing she's great. Playing great. I mean, she's she's a 1300 player. So Rahul sir, so uh, uh, currently, currently like, like, uh, are, you are you visiting any chess places? places? Oh, like, oh, like a chess street, chess street or, something. or something. Uh, I have not visited any place, but tournaments I am going local tournaments which oh, are happening. Oh. So I am like doing arbitership in local tournaments. Okay. okay. And also doing the international events. Also, I have done. Yes. 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 So as so guys, as guys, I will let you know. know. Rahul sir is a chess organizer. Also, so he so organizes organize international, international events, rated, rated events. events. So you, so can, you just can just check out, check out uh, uh, his Joshi's Chess Academy, Academy, Academy where he uh, uploads, uploads all of his all tournaments, of his tournaments and, details. and details. You can find, you it, can find it out. It was uh, uh, like long time back when I used to stream on that channel. Yeah, yeah actually, actually, we used to we do used live streaming during, during lockdowns. lockdowns. Yeah. That was also that was a great also time. Great time. Let's, Let's check, check out, out Shruti's game. game. Oh, this, this is okay. ending game. Yeah, this yeah, is ending game. Black is having too much advantage. Yeah, this yeah, is a clear win. Both, both the center pawns. Yep. yep. King is also yes, ready. This even ended also. <laughs> so I have to check it. So I am going. You both have? Yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, 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 thanks for joining. Thank, 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 thank you, thank you. Thank you, Ashwan. You can cancel it. So this is like you can say practice endgame position coming up. Yeah, now this is just uh, coming. Fi Black or... should definitely win in this. Obviously, no no chance. If you no, lose, nothing to lose here. Yeah. Full like you can say bread and butter position for Black. Black should win. Black is winning. I think this round this board is almost ended now. So let's uh, go to some other board. Akansha's position she is still thinking. Akansha's uh, position is also like the opponent is also not playing. So uh, both are taking time yeah. now. Akansha is thinking. Actually, the opponent has 21 minutes. She has thought for 40 minutes almost. Akansha mm. has what, double time. That too, I think no, it's just like uh, below 10 moves. Mm. Uh, probably she is like uh, thinking. Pressure is seeing the pressure name. Pressure Normally yeah. it happens with most of the players. Definitely also with me. <laughs> It is pressured like when you play against a title player. Definitely, yeah. So not a, not only the rating, yeah, she has the title also. That's also actually. She has the title also. Says, yeah. And she has won many uh, medals for India. Yeah, actually, I know Vedan told me that uh, she is a great chess player, and I met her. I think they are just preparing for the gold medal. I think they have a great team, for sure. Uh, let's check out the team and let's see the some predictions, sir. Just uh, change the screen. Okay, sir. Currently, you can see uh, Pune versus RT MNU. I think yes. Nagpur seems to be strong here, right? As Mrudul mm. uh, is also in their team. Yeah, Nagpur seems to be strong because Mrudul is playing. Yeah. The second one is uh, Bharati Vidyapet versus. 
एक्चुअली Definitely, it will be a very great game unless they don't uh, draw the game very soon. Yeah, but actually, it will be a great fight. <laughs> it will be a great fight. The next the one is the third board is Mumbai versus Mumbai. Yeah, the host university versus university of Mumbai. Uh, I think university of Mumbai seems to be strong, but I think our players are though they are uh, uh, beginners. Yeah, there are some experienced players like Kimaya. Kimaya Virle is an experienced player yeah. in university of Mumbai. Correct. But I think uh, though our players are beginners, but they have uh, won last. They have won both the rounds against. That's Detroit. good. Yeah, they are playing great actually. Like uh, I just mentioned, rating is just a number. We cannot de- say or determine a game with a rating. Yeah. Also, I would like to mention something that uh, we had a WFM in HSNC University's team, but uh, due to some per- or technical or what I would say personal issues, uh, she had to oh. leave, and due to that, she can't play the. Uh, next rounds, but still our team seems to be strong. No issues. The uh, team think, is doing good. Team is doing good. The next is uh, between Shivaji University and Gujarat. I think this is a balanced one, na. Still, though Kolhapur have all the rated players, but some players have the rated players in their reserves and they are not letting them play. They have kept them for future rounds, I guess. Hmm. Like not to show the moves or the game. Yeah. Old tech, old tactics. Old tactics. Next one is between Shivaji University uh, versus South Gujarat University Surat. Next is between University of Baroda versus okay this Indore. Indore MP. has all unrated players, but they have only one higher rated players, which is W F M. Nitya. Nitya. Tough job for Nitya. Nitya is a good player, but mm. other players should support. <laughs> Definitely, even if they score one point, at least they it will end in a draw. मैनेजिंग एवरी थिंग देर एंड एज वी हेड दर्बिटर राइट नाउ ऑब्वियसलीसो गोइंग टू जॉइन अस वेन यू विल बी फ्री Uh, yes, I will be happy to see Praful sir or Sandeep sir joining. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's go with the games back. I think uh, in one in we will start getting uh, the results. What happened? Yeah. So I think uh, in few uh, minutes, I think twenty thirty minutes we will start to know the results. What are the actual results going to come up? Because as the players are what we minute, predicted are right or not? Yeah, <laughs> it could totally go in opposite way also. Okay, Mrudul is playing good. Now, obviously, you can't capture with this. Or you can't. Mrudul's so position is yeah. complicated. Like this game is complicated. Mm. And just look at the last move. This was the move. Which she played. The knight takes. She went. Knight check pawn. And you can't take the knight. Hmm. This was a good move. I think uh, White missed it. Small, small things these players catch. Yeah, I think now though according to the engines, the best move is going to B three. But humanly, I don't know. <laughs> What? Uh, she's uh, able to pick like play this move queen B three. Mm-hmm. Then you can say she's listening us, but she's not. <laughs> she's not because she's playing. playing. Because it's a fifteen minutes delay, I think she would have reached some. Uh, okay, fifteen yeah, minutes delay. Fifteen minutes delay in the DC board. She might have been like in. Yeah. Almost a middle game. Also, we have the players' cameras uh, on the OBS, but due to some technical issue right now, I cannot show. I'll sort it out in the break. Okay. So your players' camera also. Yeah, yeah. We are just showing the entire hall. We have the players. Uh, like you joined the Zoom at the start. We had the players. You can we can watch it in the Zoom gallery. Yeah, I'm watching some of the like players. Yeah. 
so let's i think lot of games ending uh, the end game which we saw okay, that is ended for sure Ishita's game but this game is interesting actually Okay, this was the game I think where we were discussing yeah, with Yashwant, yeah. I think, where we were like, why it is doing good. Mm. I don't know. I mean, uh, he can't ca she she can't capture because of the move rook to c8 and lose the bishop. Yeah, she cannot capture because rook c8 check loses the bishop. Yeah, and you can't push c5. And I think that just lost. White is clearly better here. Clearly yeah, white is better, better here. And it's I think it will be just a game of conversion. It's already showing clearly it's winning. Uh, let's see how the game proceeds. I think this white white will take up this game. That's for me. Yeah, I think that uh, we can look at the game though. There is an issue with the timer. It's between Riddhi versus Riva Mahesh. Okay, I think the time shows zero zero, but they are moving. They are moving. They are the moving. Yeah, as we can see in the gallery camera also, they are still playing and uh, I think there is some time uh, glitch with the... They have moved. Yeah. Okay, yeah. rook to d8. Rook to d8, okay. It's a normal one, just play rook to d1 exchange. Yeah, rook d1 exchange. This also seems to be a draw, I guess, because though I think uh, the white is unrated and I think unrated are playing good in the openings in this mm. tournament. This this shows like they have prepared and come yeah. for the tournament. And actually, I noticed one thing when I played university last time, I saw that the unrated players are more strong. The only reason is they uh, there they are not able to play rating tournaments. That is the only reason they are not getting rating. And but the game is pretty much strong in university tournaments, definitely. Unrated are always dangerous because they will they won't take your rating, but they yeah. will take like they will not allow you to play with another rated player. Yeah, and they will also take up the motivations. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Akansha's game, sir, I think the same thing happened. Was what we predicted. Yeah, same, same thing. She captured and now also, also, also. I want to see the this game's result. Because now yeah. and also the end game part, like how Akansha will manage because White is doing great. Now also White has to keep up the tempo and uh, convert this. I, if I tell you something, uh, it's Indian is showing it's clearly winning for White's plus two almost more than that two, is yeah. there. But you are playing against a see a win is win when you win yeah. it. So she has to convert it. It will not be easy for her. Yeah, she has like one in the opening. It is. Showing good, like great advantage for her, yeah. but she has to convert. Oh, Akansha! Actually, there is Akansha is on nineteen minutes. Oh, both of them have took the equal time. Okay, now Akansha is below time. Like she will yeah. cover in time because thirty seconds increment is also there. Correct. Time is. I th I don't think time will be an issue. Correct. But I think. I feel Akansha will be hmm? like thinking for some counter plays because she won't be satisfied with the draw. I. I I hundred uh, percent. She is not satisfied. She won't with the be happy with the draw. Like she wants to win this, yes. being a, a experienced player. Correct. So this I will think, be interesting game. Uh, here, uh, as uh, it's showing, um, she should try to capture this knight as soon as possible. Mm. Now she has to figure out how she is going to do it, and she has to not lose her knight also at the same time. Because I think if they, uh, I think human, both the knights will go because yeah. both the knights if, uh, can't human, retreat yeah. back. Human perspective, it's just like a normal game. But they're what they are sitting on the hall. They don't know what is the current analysis. Yeah. Okay, so bishop e six played. Okay, bishop g five coming in. Let's see what happens. I think after just five or five minutes, we'll. Uh, Fight and mid will be in the time pressure and then we'll come to know who plays better. Let's go back to the other games. Okay, that is ended. Shita's game is done. Okay, they are still in the middle game. This. 
Okay, actually Usha is a great player. She's though a hundred player I know her and she's playing good in this. I think it should just take take. White's king is still in the center, which is a weakness also, for white. Yeah. But also is a black has to for white. be aware of this moves. Yeah. Both of them have to be aware. Both of them's king is weak, I think. King is weak for king both, is, yeah. King I, is weak I, for I agree. Both. If Black I, king is moved, white king is still in the center. But white king pieces are also not developed. The c1 bishop, the b1 yeah. knight, rooks. Okay, first of all, I think she just take it and after a knight takes you play knight g5 or you directly play knight g5 right now. So it is fine. Yeah, directly knight g5 can be played. Yeah. Okay, we have Usha over here. <laughs> Already the game is ended. There is a delay. Okay. What happened? You won? Okay, uh, as we see, uh, white has lost, but I think there is a 30 minutes delay they have kept. Oh, I think 30 minutes it. delay. Yeah. That's why the game is already ended, but uh, we have to watch it right now. Okay, so knowing the results, we are not going to look at it right now. <laughs> like uh, from here, it was cut to cut position. Yeah. For me, it was cut to good, definitely. The, good. the pieces were not developed for white. Maybe that could be the reason. Yeah. And you can say white, black was little experience as well. Obviously, obviously, if a unrated player against a rated player, they get little bit. Little, yeah, little nervous when you're playing against a rated player. Actually, let's look at this. As such, I can see there are eight games currently going on. Yeah. Which game do you want to see, sir? Any or not? Which which the position which position is going interesting? I think uh, we already uh, saw Akansha's game and it's on Bishop E6. Brudul's game. Let's see Brudul's game. Okay, let's go Brudul's game. Because Brudul's game was very complicated. Yeah. Okay. After the position was very complicated. Wait, what? After knight d5, she played queen b3. Yeah. But after that, she has went with knight to b4. Knight b4. Hmm. Okay, knight b4. Maybe trying to exchange off yep. the bishop. Okay, she played knight b4. Hmm. I am also okay. thinking same thing. Because after, I think she wants to plan after this, she wants to go d5, capturing d5. the knight. Yeah. But I don't think it was necessary over here. Night before was not. Yeah, it was not necessary. Good, maybe. Fully, uh, but there was no other squares also for the knight. I think mm -hmm. you should have just retreat back. Knight into d5 was an awesome move. Yeah. Then now, but maybe, yeah. yes, like you said, it was knight b6 was one of the moves, but then she Correct. tried to, like. I think she's playing psychologically the also. Pawn, getting the pawn in the center. Hmm. Psychology, she wants to pressurize the opponent also by playing yeah. knight to d4, what to do, why she's giving the knight for free. Um, also after Calvary, Raising questions to... in the opponent's mind by mm. playing such a move. Yes. Again, experience. She's an experienced she's player, experienced. so she knows how to play with the opponent's mind. Yeah. Also, we can't see the time in this one, right? Yeah, we, uh, time yeah, is we can't visible. see the time, yeah. Oh, this is what is what's happening over here. Just look at this one. The king is here. Both mm -hmm. of them are just attacking. But I think white white should manage or what? I think uh, white's king is plays very badly on c1. Mm. Should manage, but I think the those pawns on b and c b4 c4 mm. looks dangerous as well. Exactly. Both As compared them. to the attacks, like other the the safety of the king, black's king is open, but then white's white is not able to attack that much. Mm -hmm. But the the pawns on b4, c4 for black, the queen and the uh, rook on the a file seems dangerous. Also, like black has to calculate stuff because you can't if you play this, the position gets closed. Yeah. And if you B3, push this, B3. then this is also there, and then you can't give a check because the knight is there. 
सो आई थिंक लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स टू कैलकुलेट बट एट सम पॉइंट सी आफ्टर सी थ्री बी थ्री ब्लैक कैन सैक द नाइट द क्वीन फॉर द नाइट एंड देन दिस प्रोबेबली देर कैन बी समथिंग आई डोंट नो it is a interesting it position is a interesting because position, if you position, see yeah, on yeah. the edge file both the rooks are there mm. both the knights are defending the king and the rook on h8 is doing nothing for black correct so it, this is a sharp position this is a pretty sharp position and both of them and have time to think in this black position. being a underrated player she has managed to pressurize white mm. maybe surprise i can say correct i'm um, just this so i think this game sir uh, i am predicting that uh, white will win though engine shows a black advantage clearly but i am predicting white will win this game what what do you i think? feel i feel not because of the engine but i feel black should win this game okay. but the problem for black is the pieces are dead okay yeah so exactly managing it managing it from here will be very difficult correct so it's not like rated and unrated are playing hmm. but for example if a rated was playing in place now hmm. in like for black and definitely as a experience she she could have won the game correct but i still feel black should win this definitely I, yeah she should manage okay at 6 oh this is the best move in the position actually black six. is black is just playing so well h6 looks good because now the knight who was attacking hmm. has to retreat back because there are no other squares and i no think other squares this all the pieces and are still back but they are covering all the squares <laughs> yes they are they are not allowing anything yeah. like white can do nothing okay. because of these three pieces they are dead mm. they are making another piece dead as well mm. but <clears throat> they are stopping white to do anything correct so dead pieces also work guys look here <laughs> all the pieces are all back rank but they are doing a great job Are defending, so we'll come back to this game definitely. This is interesting this one. This is a very interesting one. And if black wins, it will be great. But let's see, it's, it's a game of chess, so yeah. anything can happen. Okay, so still this um, Rudul's game is going on, and the same thing happened actually on the board. D5 is out, and obviously you have to move the queen. You lose the knight, but you can just capture the pawn back, and I think that was a simple game. plan of knight B4, queen takes B4, yeah. and D5. But if it, i was yeah. the move that it was gives the plan up the advantage clearly you gives up the advantage because after queen a4 you just capture back and i think this is pretty fine for white i think it has a great position yes white white has managed to like you can say equalized you uh, in the opening with yeah. mrudul she has an advantage actually yeah she has an she advantage has a great advantage i think but it is like very slight very yeah, slight very advantage good. difficult to like you can mm. predict like she will win by this position yeah difficult to predict yeah, doing good obviously In the good part everybody. whatever we have seen till now or uh, the players playing with the higher players they are playing good actually yeah the lower players are playing good so queen she has taken back to d2 okay queen d2 so maybe queen like d2 then where where will you put your c1 bishop like c1 mm. bishop is block you can bring it to the some other square like b2 Hmm. But then queen d2 doesn't seems to be good. Oh yeah, because after this, what now? This is the only move. Maybe the idea for white uh, should be after she captures, she would exchange the queen. Yeah, but correct, and that then exchange the will be good for black, I think. Yeah, and now Rudul is better. So see, in just no, one or two see, moves. This is typically you can yeah. say exchange thing, exchange, ex things. exchange mentality. Yeah. Like I want to exchange queens and. Uh, ended the game in draw, but exactly. that doesn't work. Yeah, correct. So queen d2 was not a good move, and now it gives up the advantage. So if I she think she exchange, should not exchange queen c3. Obviously, she yeah, should not, not exchange, exchange. But if she exchanges it, it will be like Rudul uh, must be smiling. Okay, mm -hmm. I think after exchanging, she wants to capture this e5 pawn probably. Uh, maybe that maybe can that can be the thing. Mm. 
I guess she should directly capture. She should not directly capture e5. Yeah. That is also don't move the queen. Why? Yeah. But I think good. by play, like when she played queen d2, she wants to exchange. Yeah. Now let's see whether she will exchange or not. Yeah, I think she would play knight d4 because it's attacking the bishop at the same time you're getting this pawn. So I think it's a great move. That's that's the thing. Um. Also, after exchanging, sir. You can't. Uh, are you sure? Because after this, uh, we have this move: bishop b for attacking the rook and the knight yeah. at the same time. So that's also a thing to calculate. And right and now, after we... that, the rooks get a good, you can say, good uh, rank, good yeah. file. Hmm. Rook will be getting the d and the e file, which is good for black. Correct. A lot of things to calculate over here. A lot of things. I think. Uh, Ria should take up some time and calculate this stuff because she is playing against a WM, so that is also pressure of exchanging the queens against a higher rated player. So normally, what player think is like after the queens are exchanged, we can manage a draw. Yeah, but that's totally but, opposite. <laughs> but when you play against a higher player, they are happy. They are because happy, your yeah. power is down and they have a lot of experience playing with no queens on yeah. the board. And if they are better in the end game, they will love to exchange. And Rudil is a strong positional player. Yeah, Whatever I, think, I know, I've seen I think seen the games have ended. There is a 30 minutes delay. I think that's the reason we are uh, still watching. Yeah, we are behind. Yeah. I'll ask them to change it to 15. 15 should be fine, I guess. 30 minutes is like a big time. Yeah. Okay. Time is done. Zero it shows. Zero it shows. But there is no result till now. I think this is a, again a glitch of the clock, I guess, because the position seems to be equal. A oh, position seems to be like equal. Okay. There are it's middle game going on. Oh hmm. uh, yeah, there is a time uh, issue a little bit. No issues. Um. So sir, a final call, I just showed you this chess results, just give me your uh, predictions if possible. What do you think, who will be the there are 4 units that is going to be selected, what is your top 4 prediction? Top 4 I feel uh, Nagpur. Okay, Nagpur, then RTMU. The Pune, the RTS, the RTMU, Nagpur, then maybe the Pune this one, the, the Akancha okay. team. Okay, Bharti Vidyapit. Bharti Vidya beat. Hmm? One of the Mumbai team should be there, but. Oh, uh, yeah. Actually, University of Mumbai came in top four last year. Yeah. They were in the top four. So maybe University of Mumbai. Hmm, okay. So one, two, and three. And the last one? That's last going to one, be... I That's cannot specific. see left side pairing. Uh, okay, wait. I'll just show you this, uh, this screen. Okay. Kolhapur looks strong. Okay. Kolhapur. We have Kolhapur and also this uh, this Pune team. We can't forget about this also. They're playing on the top board. Uh, this Pune is also there. Yes. Empty. The fourth one is a little bit trickier. That the yeah, fourth one is tricky. tricky. I think na uh, Kolhapur has like good players. They are normally are there on the top four. Kolhapur, then you can say Mumbai. Okay. Kolhapur players, by seeing the players, they are experienced players. Mm. Isha Goli. Kolhapur mm. seems good as well here. Okay. So, Kolhapur is the fourth team. That's right. So, Nagpur, Bharti Vidya Beat, University of Mumbai and Kolhapur. This is the final predictions for Rahul sir. And sir, thanks a lot for giving up your time. I'm happy. Thank I'm you glad for calling you, me here. Yeah, I'm glad that you joined the stream. I would love to have you tomorrow also, if possible. Uh, during with others, Rupesh sir will be also joining us tomorrow offline during the live stream. That's great. Yeah. That's great. So if possible, if you can join tomorrow, it will be great for our viewers also. Thanks for giving your time, and uh, we'll meet again in some tournaments. Sure. Uh, <laughs> sure. Sure. Yeah, sure. So thank thanks you. Thanks for joining in, sir. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks.
I'll just set up the board. Okay, this all the games have almost ended, I guess. Um, Guys, can we just check up one of the cameras above? I can only see two of them, that's the reason. Just check it quickly and let me know. Okay, so we have the players on the board and I think there is a 30 minutes delay so all the games have almost ended so let's check out all the games quickly and then we can have a small break as you know uh, we have the fourth round on uh, two o'clock right so we have the fourth round there will be a lunch break uh, you, and after that we can just restart with the stream so I think seems all the games are still going on and bishop d6 i think knight c5 will be on board for sure and white seems to be doing good here white white is fine here pretty much good okay we'll come back to this game this is this seems to be white white is doing great over there Okay, this was the Akansha's game which we discussed earlier the position but I think now by looking at the position white has managed to get an advantage actually because now just king up and now you're losing the knight completely and how you're going to capture this knight by moving the bishop okay I think uh, you just missed this move probably I think this is a great move, but I think uh, I'm not sure that White would find this move if I move over here. Because after e5, king into e5, and then rook e1 checks, comes up, and then uh, you can't go uh, pro, uh, back. I'm not 100% sure, but I think this should be winning. This is 100% winning for White. It's convertible. Just go king d1, take up the knight. First, that should be the first aim. Rook even check. Where will you move the king? Let's give three goes to d6. Bishop check. You go to e7, and now this simple. So I think. There are a lot of things, a uh, lot of winning moves for white here. I think white should just try to find it. Uh, though uh, she has, I think she has only 10 minutes and I think it's more than enough to calculate for that. So we'll come back, we'll come back to the exam, we'll check out.
I'll just refresh the page. This seems to be fine again, but I think there is a time pressure for Black a lot. I mean, she has only five minutes. This is going to be very difficult for her by just playing because White has 22 minutes. Whites can think and play over here, but White Black has to rush a little bit because though there is an increment of 30 seconds. Okay, now the bar has went down. After this move, okay, she gave an IG5 check. Uh, as we looked at the game. Okay, it must be, uh, she must have messed up somewhere because as we saw uh, the result, White has lost the game. No issues. Uh, what we'll do, we'll take a break right now, and we will back. We will be back at two o'clock, and I will be setting the default time for the DGD board fifteen minutes, so that we can just cover up all the games. As we have the lunch break, uh, we will start up with the round, uh, and you guys can submit the board order uh, as soon as the pairings are out. I think the pairings will be out somewhere around one o'clock, so you guys can submit the board order after that. So we'll take a break, and we'll restart at two o'clock. So thanks for joining in.